Alright guys, so in this video we're going to be comparing Crisis Remastered again to Unreal Engine 4. The one I uploaded yesterday people weren't happy about because it was like comparing night and day because the Unreal Engine 4 footage was brighter and the Crisis was not. So we're going to try and fix that right now. We're going to keep playing the game until we see some daylight and compare the graphics of the Crisis Remastered to the Unreal Engine 4 map. If you haven't seen the first video, go ahead and check it out. I'll put it in the description below. Uh, before you watch this if you would like so we have the campaign I'm gonna go ahead and just continue it because somebody said I was actually really close to the daytime because the video yesterday the Sun was kind of rising in the morning so let's keep playing and see if we can get some daylight so we're comparing daylight to daylight as far as environment goes alright so if you've seen the video already I'm only gonna be doing I'm only gonna be redoing the first part so the Unreal Engine 4 footage is gonna be the same thing that I used yesterday, all right? So after watching this crisis portion, you can probably stop it because you already seen the video of the Unreal Engine 4. So here we go. He was right. It's pretty close. I should have kept going, but then again, 16 minutes of recording time is like 300 gigabytes. So here you go. Here's some daytime footage of crisis. Cutscene, I guess. Yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. So that's good. It is a little bit brighter, so we can compare it a little bit better. So somebody asked me yesterday on what I meant with the movement on these bushes and grass. I think. Well, what's going on? Uh. So when I said I think it's just the materials. You can do it similarly in Unreal. The materials are actually just changing, if you would, animating instead of an actual wind. Because you can see right there, it looks like the material is moving. That's how I guess they did it, but I could be wrong. So let's keep moving here. Get some more footage of you guys. Or for you guys. Let's see if I can find a tree here. Okay. Oh, man. There's enemies in here. I don't want to fight. I just want to look. Yeah, the mouse sensitivity is... I don't, I don't know what FPS this is running. But I'm getting a pretty good delay on the mouse here. Uh, yeah. You can, see, you can probably tell. Whoa. Sorry, guys. I didn't know there's so much firefighter here. Okay. So I was checking out the trees. Alright. Where am I supposed to be going? Straight? Alright, let's go. It is pretty beautiful though for a 14 year old game. It was definitely... It was definitely ahead of its time. Wow, those guys are like stormtroopers. They can't hit for jack crap. Alright, this guy's annoying. I'm gonna have to take him out. Alright, take him out. Oh, he just, he just spoke English! Alright, so here we go. This is nice. Oh, that's pretty. Alright, guys. Sorry, I gotta kill this dude. He's, he's um, damaging me quite a bit. Stop giving me the mission mission details. I don't care. I just want to keep enjoying this environment, bro. This is pretty. Can you imagine having to finally having the hardware to play this game at full whenever my 80, 90 comes in the mail? It's pretty good. Ooh, that tree just fell down. It's too far. Beautiful. Okay. It is pretty. I'll give it that. No. Go away. Go away. 
I'm just here to enjoy the view. These guys are annoying. What's their problem? Oh, dude, I'm about to die. How do you heal? I, even I think my headphones is reversed because I hear him, but I'm looking the wrong way. Hang on. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Yeah, my, my earpiece are definitely swapped because I was looking the other way. Oh my god. Epic fail, dude. Right, I only got 38 bullets left. Oh, okay. So yeah, you can see a little bit better. Does it have physics? Oh, it has a little bit of physics there. Oh wow, that jump is pretty delayed. Let's check a look. Oof, good thing I turned off motion blur, because that almost made me dizzy. How did people play this 14 years ago? There's n absolutely no way you could have played this game at full res. Because even my 49er right now is crying a little bit. I mean, 40-90, 30 This is beautiful, though. Okay. Am I going the right way? I think so. I hope I, I hope I don't make you guys throw up. So all these motion. There you go. Get some sun. Ah. I don't have any more bullets. Yeah, I should really flip my headset. Hang on. Alright, that's better. Oh my god. They're right there. Oh, I got a pistol. How do you crouch? Oh, Charlie. The mouse delay is so bad, dude. There's no way. He just threw something at me. What is it? I can't aim with this latency. Alright, they got god mode on on this, guys. What the heck, dude? What do you have, a BB gun? Do I have a BB gun, guys? Yeah, I'm dead. That was terrible, dude. Oh no, not this far out. Okay, I'm not gonna play it again, but hopefully that is a little bit better comparison than my earlier one, because you can actually see daytime. Um, but yeah, I, I can't, I can't play with this lag. Like, it's pretty bad. Uh, but yeah, hopefully that's a little bit better. I'm going to be doing Kingdom Come Deliverance because that, that game kept coming up as well. So we'll check that out and compare that with a different Maui map in Unreal Engine 4. See you guys later. Okay, so the Challenger. Unreal Engine 4 Birch Forest Biome by Maui United. And like I said, this is one guy that made this map. So don't expect a full video game because this is just an environment. Alright, so I have this loaded in my editor, and yeah, let's, I already set this uh, pie here to 4K, 3840 by 2160, so let's get started. Crisis versus Unreal Engine 4. 250 people versus one. <laughs> I don't know. 
Yeah, there's no way. There, there's no way. As far as realism, right, for the realistic here, talk about physics and all that stuff because that takes a lot. As far as just the look of it, holy shnikes. This is different, man. It's. And I just saw that he actually made this map back in 2020. So it's the same year that the Crisis was remastered. But this is Unreal Engine 4, guys. Look at this tree. Now when Unreal Engine 5 comes out, I think that's 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 going to do it. But you can kind of see why people were comparing Crisis to this map when I made it last month. Because there's some similarities as far as the environment. You know, forest to forest and stuff like that. Now, I'm not sure if Crisis was photo scanned, but I know for sure these are. Because he actually scans and takes uh, pictures of the, the trees that he puts in these maps. And again, by himself. That... I have totally I totally respect people that are their, that are kind of like on their own because I'm in the same way. Um this is a lot of work, man. And I I I support his his maps like all day. I want him to make more to be honest cuz this is this is an amazing map. And now we're actually able to capture it in 4K because last month that was only 1440p because of my um Laptop, it was the dinosaur that I was talking about. Alright, let's walk around. So, basically, if you can find 249 people, you guys can download this map and make a game out of it. You know? And it's just incredible. This, this thing is just sitting in there, waiting for somebody to go grab and make a game out of. Or a movie. And the cool thing about this is ray tracing is not even on. This is just standard. There's no ray tracing in this map at all. So you can only imagine, right? Look at this. I turned off motion blur as well because I know you guys were getting sick. But yeah, I mean, hopefully this kind of settles the argument of which graphics looks better as far as realism you know like photo real crisis remastered or unreal engine force maui environment i don't know let me know in the comments below what you guys think but i don't know i feel i feel like this is more realistic than the uh, crisis remastered This is legit like walking outside your house. Th just look at this. I wonder how he did that. That's actually pretty detailed. Oh, this little moss around the root. 